right? We have uh, seen the different preparations of alkanes, isn't it? I have taught you different different types of reductions. I have shown you electrolytic uh, electrolysis process, decarboxylation process. So please go through all the reactions. Keep noting it and keep to first understand the reaction. Then you will not forget it. Okay. Now we will come back to the physical properties of alkanes. Okay. What is this question? Why are the first four members that is C1 to C4 gases? C5 to means C1, the first uh, methane, ethane, uh, propane, butane, why are they gases and remaining are liquids and the higher members are waxy solids. What is the reason? So when such reasoning questions are given to you, you should just be clear in answering. Just give answer uh, answer to the particular question. Very small, short answer, important and important keyword should be there. Done. So first of all, whenever I speak about alkenes, what, what bonds do they have? They have carbon, carbon bond and carbon hydrogen bond done right here when i have to see the electronegativity difference between carbon and hydrogen carbon what is electronegativity doing the electronegativity of carbon here it is 2.55 the electronegativity of hydrogen is 2.2 only now when the difference of both is very very less isn't it you see the, if there is a lot of difference they start dragging the electron means they start try to pull the shared pair of electrons when they try to pull the shared pair of electrons ions are created polarity is created now the difference in electro first important point electronegativity difference is very very less electronegativity difference is very less isn't it minimal when the electronegativity difference is very less, what will happen? Will it exist as a polar molecule? No, isn't it? So, alkenes are non-polar molecules. Non-polar molecules. So, when it is non-polar molecule, what will happen to the Van der Waals forces of attraction? If it is polarity, that Van der Waals forces of attraction exist between them. But because it is non-polar, so they have weak Van der Waals forces of attraction so because of this what happens there are no forces of attraction to make the molecules stay together as a solid that's why because of this weak van der waals forces the elements are far away means they exist as gaseous they, the, the physical state is gaseous because there is no force of attraction between them that's the reason because of this you will write these three points then you will finish off saying that hence c1 to c4 are gases C5 to C17 are liquids, the higher members are waxy solids.